teacher, can you teach me how to spell these words? Teacher, could you please help me to find the meaning of the words? Teacher, I need help to learn English. Teacher, how can I construct a simple sentence? All these phrases have been a common phenomenon being an wet teacher for my students in my daily life. Therefore, let me introduce you to the title of my study, that is, Quest After the Used Me to Increase Vocabulary Words Among the Five Met Students in a Secondary School in Penang Island. Good day to the panel of judges and dear audience. First and foremost, let me take into the journey of my students. The sample of my study are five out of 12 students from an upper secondary school in Penang Island. My students became a sample due to these reasons. They hail or derive, they come from a low social economy status family whereby they are being brought up by their sole breadwinner parents, a single mother or father. Besides that, they were lacking in the initiatives to learn English, especially to learn new vocabulary words by themselves. Few of them have also been working as part-time workers at any nearby places they were able to reach out. Therefore, they were not being exposed to speaking English or even to read English materials. Hence, the journey started when I had some observations with my students. Based on my observations and marking of essay, I've noticed that they were lacking in sufficient vocabulary comprehensive skills and also in writing complex sentence, especially when it comes to writing complex sentence for essay. Essay encompass two part, which is question one and question two for web writing component. Therefore, for question two, the marks 60 is the full marks. Hence, they have to obtain at least 30 marks to ensure that overall writing component reach at least 45 of 90 marks. I had challenges when I was marking the five of their essays, especially in when it comes to constructing sentence. They were only able to construct simple sentence as compared to complex sentences. Besides that, adding on with errors and mistakes of spelling, not only that, insufficient vocabulary was also one of the hindrances that they face when they come to writing. Therefore, let me introduce you to the general objective of this study. The general objective of this study is we expect the students to pass the MUET general MUET exam with at least band 3 and the contribution also comes from the writing component whereby we expect them to obtain at least 45 or over 90 marks. Next, the specific objective of this study is at least the students should be able to learn five new words per week. Next, they should utilize the five words that they learn at least five to ten or more words in a week through their writing when they construct simple sentence or even complex sentences. Next, the research method. How did I introduce this study to my students? Based on my preliminary study, as, as I've said earlier, based on my observation and essay marks at the, as the intervention of the study, I had come up with this research with my friend. Well, how did I go about with the instrument? I introduced a flashcard strategy of used me which is more of self-learning strategy. The students were being exposed on how to collect the material and the project 
or what do you call this? The instrument has been named as used to me. So what is used to me? Used to me is a collection of recycled materials of printed materials such as newspaper, magazines, journals or even old storybooks together with other recycled materials such as or can say that more of like other recycled things such as cans, food wrappers and also anything sufficient reliable for the students to read and derive words, new vocabulary words for them to use in their process of making the flashcard strategy. So upon collecting these items, they have to look into the two category of words which is going to be semi-familiar and unfamiliar words. So in these two categories, they have to categorize the semi-familiar and unfamiliar words. They were also taught dictionary referencing skills, referencing skills whereby they were taught how to find for the meaning of the words and write down the meaning of the words on the flashcards. So two categories with two different colors of pen and they have to write down the meaning of the words. Each day before they come to school, usually the days that I have focused were Thursdays and Fridays before school and after school hours, they have to develop the card. Once they develop the card, they have to take back and they refer it daily. It is going to be like a bedtime story for them whereby they will look into the cards before they sleep. Consciously and unconsciously, learning occurs when they look at something as practice makes it perfect. So the time duration was 20 minutes before and after for the selected dates of Thursday and Friday. This is how I started with that instrument. Along the way, the students were given eight weeks to accomplish the task. However, unfortunately, what we were expecting did not turn out to be. They were flaws. From the student's side, I could see gradually the interest to create the flashcard strategy has deteriorated. From week one to week five, they were able only to collect five words or to create five words and to learn five words. End of the day, I have to think for a second thought. How could I help them? Well, along the way, as the, what do you call this, as the instrument was delayed in the development, I was also looking into their marks for essays that I've given. At least two essays per student, so five samples, at least minimum two essays. So they were supposed to use the words that they have created in their writing and usually related to environmental questions. What I've found that their interests were lacking and things has to be done. Therefore, I had to change the strategy. Well, I gave them a different way of thinking. How they can make things in a fun way and learn in a very exciting way so that learning can be more meaningful per se. What happened? I had to create a strategy, a new strategy, which is known as vocabulary tree. They are going to do the same way how they have developed the flashcard strategy. But here, I've given them the empowerment and autonomy to think out of the box. They were given suggestions to create the vocabulary tree. But the means of doing it, it depends on how they're going to do it. The time is going to be the same on Thursdays and Fridays, 20 minutes before and after the school. However, their creativity is the ask. Therefore, I could see the changes in their behavior, in their habits. Every day, not only the five of them, but also their friends, they were helping each other by collecting the used me materials and they passing it to their friends, five of the samples of the study. I could see the vocabulary tree was blooming prosperously. 
the more adding on of words and new words have been accumulated and it was expanding tremendously. So the changes have been witnessed here. Well, how do I know what happened to my students? How do I compare? I had to look into the take of value marks when they came into the school as compared to the actual MWET exam results. What I had noticed, the students, five of them, who fall in category of band two, have improved to band three and band four when the actual results were out. This was mind-blowing and out of nowhere, they have bloomed to gradually improve. Along the way, they have learned new vocabulary, they had constructed complex sentence as compared to the initial stage. Towards week six, seven and eight, the development of vocabulary tree had been tremendously improved. Therefore, what can I say? I can say that if you opt for a second choice, they were given the empowerment and autonomy to develop their own phase of self-learning strategy, they were able to make miracle. End of the day, what I can say, you can make differences because every one of them are unique. Well, in conclusion, this strategy from flashcard strategy, it became vocabulary tree strategy the students have developed gradually. And it has actually benefited the slow learners tremendously, even though a lot of perseverance and hard work had to be put in, but they have developed gradually along the way. And this had made a lot of difference in my students' life. Well, as the saying goes, practice makes it perfect. And of the day, they were able to make a lot of differences in their life. And the proof was shown from the results that I've obtained. All five of them were able to obtain band three and above. So precisely four with band three and one with band four. And I attained 100% passes for my class. This study not only could be constrained for the subject of writing or learning vocabulary per se, but it can be implemented in other components and across the curriculum. Therefore, if time permits, more in-depth research could be done on this. With that, I end my poster presentation. Thank you very much for patiently listening to my study. Thank you.